In Sunday science, we are nearly two weeks away now from the total solar eclipse that most of the country will see. Storm Team 10's Jason Doris is here now to let us know what we could expect right here in southern New England. Good morning. Good morning, Liz, and good morning to everyone. We have been talking about this eclipse now for quite some time. We're expecting the path of totality to be crossing through portions of northern New England and here locally in Providence. We're expecting about 92% coverage of the sun, so it's going to be pretty cool. But the big question is, especially as we get closer, you might start to see maybe a couple of forecasts for April 8th popping up on social media. Not sure if you want to quite believe those just yet. It's going to be another week before we can really get into the details on what's going to be happening. But for now, we can look at the climatology of what usually happens around April 8th across southern New England. And one of the big things is going to be the cloud cover. We can see here maybe April, not our best month to be viewing an eclipse, just because we typically see cloud cover around 60 to 80 percent across the area. So that could be one of the limiting factors as we get closer to this event. But two out of our last three April 8th, on uh, 2023 and 2021 sunshine, but also taking a look at the last 10, we've had rain on six of the last 10. So as a whole, all the way back to 1905, it's about a 42% chance to see rain on that day and only about a 20 to 40% chance of sunshine. As we get closer though, tomorrow will be two weeks out from the solar eclipse. You wanna make sure you get your solar eclipse glasses because that is your protective wear that you're gonna wanna need. And they're a little bit stronger than sunglasses because when you put them on, you look a little funny, but I'll tell you what, you can't see anything at all. And that is how you know you actually have a good pair of some solar eclipse glasses. And sunglasses are not strong enough to actually protect you from the harmful rays coming from the sun. Liz?